Hey guys, good morning. It's me, Steve. Hopefully still your favorite engraver. Well, real quick, I told you guys as I came up with faster solutions to my problems up here, I was going to share them with you. Well, this was another one. This is a foraged footboard post, okay? It's, it's first thing Sunday morning, so please bear with me. I haven't had all my coffee yet, all right? I told you that we take this material and we scribe the feet, and going forward I will not be gluing things together and, and hanging myself, okay? What we do, okay, I told you, is we, we scribe the bottom. This is just a black, and you can get them at the buck store or whatever, just a Sharpie marker, okay? Well, the one thing I got tired of doing was I kept rotating my log on the floor. Uh, I told you how to shim it. You know, you can use a, a cedar shake or, you know, whatever you got, a little rip off of a, off a board, or you could even use a bent over a couple pieces of cardboard box if you wanted to act as a shim to get your log, you know, where you want it. Well, lo and behold, I found this old Lazy Susan base. I don't remember where it came from, but it served the purpose flawlessly for me. You know, I can shim this however I need it, and I can rotate it, I can step back about where the camera is, and I can look at it, okay? Uh, well, that's not right, I shim it here. Once I've got everything shimmed where I want it, I can take my marker, and I can go around the bottom, and I can put a nice heavy line on it, and then lo and behold, I can take it out of my big chop saw, I can cut it down, Put it back, and if I have to make another adjustment, we just repeat the same step. But this has saved me some significant amount of time versus sitting on the concrete floor, stepping back. No, I don't like it that way. It, it just it saves some time. I just wanted to share that quick tip with you guys. I hope it works. And uh, hey, happy bed building, all right? Guys, you're great. Thank you so much. And uh, we've got more coming at you. Stay tuned, all right? Bye-bye.